HOV lanes across Houston's freeways just reopened this afternoon after a major malfunction. Channel 2's Jace Larson is live near downtown. Jace, a really bizarre story about how this all began. Yeah, it sure is. And the good news for people getting on the road right now is that system wide, all of these HOV and HOT lanes are now back open. They opened just about 325 uh, this afternoon. If you look back there, this is the southbound lanes of the Gulf Freeway, the HOV entrance right there. Let me show you what caused this whole thing. You called it bizarre. I think lots of other people would agree. It was a fire at this house that happened at Cortland and 34th in the Heights. It happened early this morning. And here's what it did it damaged the Comcast. Cast lines that run the HOV lanes. Because of that fire, Metro could not tell the status of these gates, so it decided to shut them down system wide. We spoke with Metro's uh, spokeswoman who explained why just one fire could cause so many problems. Turns out the fire had severed or burned a cable which delivers information to Transtar, just electronic information to Transtar about what's going on with our HOV, HOT operations. Well, if you lived in the Heights and you have Comcast, you already know this. It also knocked out internet, uh, phone, and also cable service to many people around that fire area in the Heights. The good news, though, now, it appears as though things are back to normal. They certainly, uh, traffic is flowing right here. If you're trying to go on this uh, particular part of the southbound lanes, uh, headed down to Galveston, and again, elsewhere, we're told the lanes there are open as well. We're live near downtown. Jace Larson, KPRC Channel 2 News.